Transport Corporation of India highlights clear trends in the supply chain management. Omnichannel uh, D2C direct to consumer is something that's uh, it's a big trend. Um, again, D2C is very, very interesting because a lot of D2C companies are saying that, look, I don't need to have excess inventory. On the omni-channel side also, I think it's moved towards uh, e-commerce is more or less like a, fri it's a frictionless world. The other hardcore stuff that's happening is things like multimodal. Mm -hmm. um, companies are moving more and more to uh, other modes of transport other than road. So you're seeing a big trend towards rail, big trend towards coastal shipping because consumers are not just wanting to see lower cost but also green logistics it is a trend that is quite visible it has started to happen um, and actually really good for our country because we need to make this change towards multimodal the other is of course any kind of digital transformation exercise i think that has accelerated in all companies air cargo club of delhi hosted a luncheon for its members at radisson blue plaza new delhi Air Logistics Group discusses the evolving dynamics in the air cargo sector. Cargo has come as a savior. When passenger flights have uh, kind of shut down, today you see um, P2C, what we have now called as the new terminology is called freighters, has come up. And we have uh, retrofitted aircraft, the passenger seats are being removed because all the revenue generated is cargo. So today, airlines are seeing the stepchild, the stepchild, which was cargo, as being in the fourth seat. Pharmaceutical was and is already training supreme. And actually, if you see the airlines, we prefer pharmaceuticals because vis-a-vis -vis the yields we get, on uh, general cargo and what we get on pharmaceuticals is higher. Royal Cargo unveils its new vaccine depot in the Philippines.